First thing to note about number 16 is since it is the first of the free response grid in questions, it's supposed to be easy, right? The difficulty resets, so this shouldn't be hard. If it feels hard, it's probably you just kind of getting overwhelmed. Take a deep breath. You can get these points. In fact, you must get these points. These are fairly easy. So let's look at what they want. What is the volume in cubic centimeters of a right rectangular prism that has a length of 4 centimeters, a width of 9 centimeters, and a height of 10 centimeters. So a right rectangular prism, that's a, just a box. And look, maybe you didn't love geometry and you forgot a lot of the formulas, but don't forget this. The formulas are mostly given to you in the reference chart at the beginning of the section. So you have to know to check this. Sometimes there will be things that are not there that you need, and there are some geometry rules that need to be memorized. But regardless, check here first. And sure enough, we have a right rectangular prism, and they give us the volume formula. So volume is equal to length times width times height. So let's go back to our question, and we're just going to use that formula with the information we're given. So let's bring that up to here. Length times width times height. Okay. So we're given a length of 4, a width of 9, a height of 10. Let's multiply 4 times 9 first, 36. 36 times 10 is 360. That's the whole question. So don't get intimidated. Make sure you jump to questions like this to get these easy points. Even without a calculator, the math is not bad and they give you the formula. There's really nothing you need to do except follow the instructions here, plug numbers into that formula, and you're done. Easy 10 points.